Hello, hi, Assalamualaikum Warahmatullahi Wabarakatuh So today I would like to share with you about my presentation which is my, so basically fast travel is our name, our company is Create a Tourism Website So next is overview, overview for fast travel is a travel website where customer can access the website easily without any additional charge This website was established to make it easier for tourists to travel to interesting place in Malaysia The cost to create a website is a zero ringgit with only a stable internet so the last but not least, the purpose of this paper is to present the tourism website for has travel which cover management, marketing, service and financial aspect. So this is our overview for Fahas Travel. So next is our vision and mission Fahas Travel. Our mission is committed to the realization of this, of this vision as we strive to be recognized by organization and travelers alike as one of Malaysia's most outstanding center for, of tourism planning and tour. We aim to be a recognized and certified program by 2022. And uh, our mission is Fast Travel is a provider of competency-based expedition, multi-team activities, economical and sustainable tourism project, in line with transformation in the sector and relevant to those who aim to pursue a budget quality experience in the tourism and allied industry. So next is goals and scope. So goals for Fast Travel is our organization main goals are to gain a deeper understanding of diverse culture, to improve the resident's quality to life, to improve the resident quality of life, to create facilities that are both community and tourism focused, instilling pride in one traditional culture and identity. And our scope is tourism planning has come a long way in the tourism development process, but still there are there is a ample scope for betterment. There is a six point four scopes, which is number one is transport. Number two, accommodation. Number three, tourist activity. Number four, product development. Number five, marketing and promotion. And number six, quality standard of tourism service. So next is uh, our organization for Faha Travel, which is five participants. And number one is project manager. Project manager is Muhammad Hazrul Koyum. And next is advisor. Advisor is Muhammad Arif. So next is accounting and finance, which is uh, Muhammad Adi Aiman. So next is design leader, which is uh, me, Muhammad Nufan, Mabin Mu'aris. And the last is team member which is this team member is Muhammad Zikri bin Arudin. So this is our organization, Fahas Travel. That's all from me. Thank you. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. My name is Muhammad Adib Aiman bin Abu Samad. And now, I will continue about the schedule of this project. So, based on this table, our group start this project on 7 October, which is discussion of group and planning mission and vision. On 14 October, the goal and scope of the project described, detail on the project. 4 November, Project plan review and resources are collected from other sources from group members. 18 November, design website and architecture website review. 25 November, draft documentation and coding finish. 9 December, website test and last 23 December, close project. And now I will explain about the budget. First, human resource, 2,500 will be distributed to each person. Next, purchase COTS, which means hotel and buffet, hotel 250 ringgit and buffet 150 ringgit will be paid on each milestone. Next, equipment, as much as 100 ringgit is paid on old achievement and tools, which mean first aid, 50 ringgit on two initial and final achievement for training the first two are paid as much as 200 ringgit then paid 100 ringgit for promote only next other as much as 100 ringgit is paid on old achievement so total accumulate for this website is 80,900 ringgit assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh my name is Muhammad Arifuddin bin Muhammad Ali my metric number is 1181681. Now I would like to talk about the risk management. First is one uh, of risk management uh, we involve is resources and achievable. Prototype was created by the first time. Its invention may have problems in accessing from the customer side. Thus, we must, re uh, we must treat this problem by providing a guideline for small errors. And if it continues, the server will be restarted. And then the in, about the interface crash, 
which is our company is at risk if the website keeps getting crashed during the online process because the number of users exceeds the maximum capacity of the website. And then there's a expired security. Our company may have a problem in ensuring the safety of the user when the antivirus for the website expires. Next, we talk about the research activities and milestone. The available one describe the project, the project manager go over goals and objective from various from various company existed with one and two for the blended. Then uh, content manager goes over the important characteristic of website interface and attractive attributes on week three until week five. On deliverable three, risk manager collects data taken on risk management to treat and publish websites to the public. Uh, on week six until eight, D four, the marketing manager goes over quotes and interesting facts to cultivate interest in the public advertisement. On week nine, and then lastly, the project manager finance data are taken and updates them in the final report to the lecture. On week ten until eleven. That's all for me. Thank you. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Muhammad Zikir bin Mahayrudin. Metric number 1181691. Today, I will explain to you about two points uh, in my group, which is first, security aspect. Second, in aspect. Okay, first, security aspect. First point is, tourists are increasingly concerned about safety and security as the millennium progress. Second, all tourist location must prioritize safety and security as a top priority. Tourists are no longer confined to a specific socio-economic class and the scope of travel has expanded to include more and more countries. Outbreak disease also being the main factor for tourists to visit our country. Disease such as pandemic COVID-19, influenza and SARS is the big disease that can de can affect the tourists. Malaysia must be vigilant and well prepared in the face of increasingly uncertain event in the future. Okay, next is Ina aspect. First, Islamic tourism is a synthesis of two disciplines, which is tourism and the aspect of Islamic teaching. Islam encourages human to go for travel and this is stated in the Quran also. Islam is not only religion that emphasizes traveling, other religions also look at tour and travel as good activity and give value to society. Muslim must have strong to desire to serve to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala by traveling and adhering to his rule and obligation. Islamic tourism can have a physical impact on the traveler, allowing them to relieve stress and also and other problem, while also maintaining a healthy lifestyle. That's all from me. Thank you. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. So my name is Muhammad Azra Qayyum Mijamza, metric number one one eight one seven zero three. I will explain the abbreviation and definition from our report. So Fahas Fahas is a tourism company, which is our company's name. Uh, each alphabet stands for the founder's name, start from the F, Fahmi, Arifudir, Hazrul, which is me, uh, Adib and Zikri, and we combine the words in, and turns to be our company's name. Second, we go to the multi-team. Multi-team consists of textual uh, or interpersonal of both beside the topical team. Uh, concerning multiple teams, the frequency and percentage of textual and interpersonal Team types were calculated and tourism. Tourism is a social, cultural and economic phenomenon uh, which entails the movement of people, countries or place outside the usual environment, personal or business uh, purpose. The next one is the cultural diversity. Cultural diversity is the quality of diverse or different cultures as opposed uh, to monoculture, the global monoculture uh, or homogenization of cultures akin to culture evolution. Uh, the term cultural diversity can also refer to having different cultures respect each other's difference. Uh, so the COTS, COTS means the commercial of the shelf. 
Meanwhile, IP uh, is information technology. URL is a uh, uniform resource locator. And last one, the Java. Java is a company programming, computer programming language. Okay, next. This is our teaser from our website. That's all from us. Thank you.